So, yeah. So KJ, obviously a lot of talk has been centered around you moving to the four. Mm -hmm. Have you? What's what's your routine been like? Have you been working on your jump shot? There's been all kinds of talk and kind of what's your routine been like since the end of the season? Yeah, just trying to get more reps on the shots. Um, might be four, might be five. It just depends on whatever coach feels best for me. What do you think the biggest adjust having a guy like Hunter? What do you think your biggest adjustment will be, and what will be the greatest asset to you? Uh, just trying to play off him and just try to do what we could to move around him because Hunter's a, a very special player. So just trying to move off him and make sure I can get open. You've been kind of making the rounds working at different camps so far this summer. What's that experience been like for yourself? So it's far? been cool. It's, it's probably the best part of the summer just to be with the kids and just see them around and kind of go off the energy because it, it makes our, our days better when we see them, see our small and just see how grateful they are to just be over here. KJ, it's basically almost a new team. Mm -hmm. What's it been like just getting to know a lot of the new guys? It's been it's been it's been really fun, honestly, because it's, it's been like we've been together for four years. Um, I think the team really clicks, and I think we genuinely like each other. So we've just been hanging around with each other. A lot of people went to a Luke Holmes concert together, so it was just cool just to be with them and just have have a good time with with each other. And it, uh, I think uh, Dewan said last week that you and your girlfriend had everybody over for dinner and cook. What, what was that like, and what's that like for team camaraderie and just to get all the fellas together? Yeah, it's, it's, it's always a good thing. Um, I'm waiting uh, waiting for Kevin and Marcus to get back so they don't feel feel like they missed out. So um, it, it's just good just to, so that we could do things like that. And I, I think we'll do a lot of stuff like that more so we can actually get more bonding. Where did you grill? Or was it grilling? No, we, I, we did tacos. In McCarthy Hall? Yeah, yeah, in McCarthy. <laughs> what is your secret? to cooking <laughs> my, uh, my secret to cooking is uh, having a girlfriend that does most of it that's a secret because <laughs> somebody said it was good yeah I, I hope it was good and my girlfriend did a lot of work to it <laughs> do the coaches want to get in on it and uh, eat coach it coach KT always talks about he, he wants to get the food but I, I never really fixed for him it's for the team <laughs> I think on the season ending banquet coach said that he would go to war with you and you're the guy he always wants What's when you hear from, uh, from a Hall of Fame guy what's that What's that mean? Yeah, it's just it's just very inspiring just to know that I'm I'm doing the right things and doing what I need to do to build that type of trust. So just having a guy like that um, talk about you like that makes you feel good and wants you makes you want to do it play harder. KJ Coach said I think on a podcast that he made a commitment to you to play you on the wing more mm -hmm. next year. Just what have those conversations been like with him about your future position? Yeah, he's just telling me just to work on my shot a little bit more, try to get more comfortable, get some more live reps because that that's really going to help me. If, if we make the transition or if we stay, if, just making my shot better will help me in the four or the five anyway. So that's basically what I need to do. And where would you prefer to play? Really anywhere, wherever they put me. I don't really have a special role that I want to play in. I, I really just can play in whatever system he puts me in. Compared to like last year, how do you feel about your shot overall? And you've been working on it all summer. Yeah, I'm just I'm just getting more comfortable in it. Um, I obviously don't have that many live reps as I could, so just trying to shoot more in live situations when we play up and down at five on five is just really just gonna help it. Do you think we'll see a lot of that out there in the Puerto Rico games maybe? Uh, we'll see. Um, it depends on what kind of system coach runs, so it just depends on um, how the team's going and all just depends on when we get there. What do you think of Jamari's game? I like Jamari how he plays. He's a good shooter, he's a good playmaker. He's a little goofy sometimes, but he's a good all around player. And to make such a big donation why did you do that? And isn't that pretty nice of you to, to give that kind of money to yeah, the it, cause? Yeah, it's always good that we can do stuff. Always give back. Um, it it kind of hit hit my heart a little bit because my mom's kind of going through the same stuff that the kids are going. So just to give back, and now that we have the stuff to give back, it's always good to do that, and it helps me a lot when I do that. Was that a spur of the moment decision, or was that something you were planning on doing coming into the night? Well, I I, I called uh, Brian Haney before that and told him I wanted to do that just because it kind of hit my heart, and I just wanted to see the kids happy and, and not stress a lot because they already have a lot of stress in their mind. Thanks,